Welcome back folks to Let's Play Crusader Kings 2, and when we last left off, Galicia are in serious trouble. They originally under Portugal had these two territories. In Vengeance, I have been stealing their territories. I have to wait two years, but after those two years, I can strike to claim the entire of Galicia. And with the entire of Galicia under my control, I can then basically rule Galicia as king. Sounds like a good plan. That claim was gained so quickly, by the way, that I can't even switch the Chancellor away to claim somewhere. What has just happened there? Right! Looks like uh, they've managed to claim somewhere else. And now I'm old. Epic beard time. Looks like I might have to claim this territory too. Oh, it's all right. I can get that territory in my own time. I can ask if he wants to join me. The answer will probably be no. But he doesn't have to join me because eventually I will just crush him. Crush him underfoot. I might want to give away Devon, just so I can uh, keep Karuna. Right. Let us think about somewhere next to claim. I'm actually vaguely tempted with Mercia. Yes, it's Desiree of Andalusia, but... There's also this guy. He's pretty much powerful, though, considering he's actually, for some reason, there, even though his kingdom's all the way over here. By the way, Abyssinia, well done. Again, whoa! Okay, what's happening here? Oh, wow! Jerusalem is actually rebelling against the Byzantine Empire in a war against their tyranny. That's actually really cool. And there are not many people for her to marry. I was hoping she'd take the vows. Just gotta wait a little while. A little while. I opened the stable door a quick bit and accidentally stumbled on Stefan getting his first kiss. I suddenly realized Stefan is becoming a man. I should tell him about courtly love. The chase trait is not the best trait to have in a king, but I've seen worse. His piety gain is going to go through the roof. Which is handy. My kinsman. A le wow, really? Can I educate him? I'm vaguely curious, actually. Yeah, why not? I'll educate this uh, legitimized uh, member of my family. I can press a ducal claim. Uh no. Is this a new king? Oh, this is a new king. Oh, you are in so much trouble. The old king has died. Which means... My grandson is actually going to inherit this king. This uh, title. My grandson may be the one to inherit the title. However... I want the title now. And I'm going to call in... My nephew, who is on the throne of the Byzantine Empire. A Byzantine Revolt. Uh, actually, no, I'm not going to call him in. I could call in the King of Scotland. Yeah. I could call in the King of Navarra, too. Yeah, let's do that. Okay. Not raising my own levies, of course. Again, no need to. We'll just muster some troops. Ready them all for the eventual conflict that is to come. Right. 900 men. Okay, that's a joke. <laughs> that is officially a joke. You really think I'm going to be scared of 9,000 men? Uh, the King of Scotland's all game for this war. And so is the King of Navarra. Ho! You have no soldiers! Do you have any soldiers? Not really either. 
That's irrelevant, though. How many troops do you have access to? Not a lot. 4,000? Yeah, not a lot. I haven't even raised my own levies. So... And I've got 4,000 men. Well over. Yeah, yeah. This is, uh... This is not going to go well for you. I'm just going to say that right now. So, Galicia! I don't rate their chances of anything. Not really. I'm going to move these 51 boats over here. So how many men? 2,000. 2,000 men. We might actually need to go help them. We might actually need to go help them. My niece requires an educator. Pick someone who's not terrible. You'll actually be fine. Bit late on that one, though. So, uh... 16 men, eh? Would you like to fight this army? No, didn't think so. You don't get a choice, by the way. You're fighting this army. When their morale gets high, we're going to come in and crush you. And then we're probably going to force you to actually uh, swear fealty to us. Hey, uh, 2,000 men. Meet 4,000. Kapow. We also captured someone. This war is going to be very short. Yeah, this, this war is going to be a quick one. Well, there's an allied army there. They must be busy. How's your civil war doing? My nephew? Do it okay? No. <coughs> no, no it isn't. How oh, nice to know the Maelor dynasty is actually doing stuff. Ah, 119 men. How's it going? My son-in-law has just died under suspicious circumstances, which technically means that my own kin, my grandson, is uh, now ruling, which kind of sucks, but I'd rather have the power than him. He may not like me. He actually does quite like me. We're at war, but that's okay. I think we we'll split this, uh... New unit, please. Just have the... Retinue, 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 retinue... Bingo. We'll have that army. Go over here and just do some, uh... Crushing. We don't even have enough soldiers... Up that, um... We're losing money, so... Are you going to surrender yet? It would be nice. Surrender? No, he's not going to surrender yet. He will? Just not yet. And a marriage proposal. My daughter with the... No. No, France is actually turning out to be quite a threat now, and Aquitaine is soon going to be a nothing. And, uh, no. I know you're desperate for claims on my territory, and I'm not interested in giving them to you. Yay! My son is finally kind. Also, this rebellion of yours is really going badly. Force Stefan to learn how to fight. Yeah! Brave trait! Like that trait. I could also ask my nephew to help me. But I'm not interested. He needs all the power he can get, and I'm not going to help him. He needs to help himself. He got himself in that mess. He's going to have to fight himself out of it. Wow, look what happened to the Spanish Peninsula. The only bit that's relatively stable is this part. This bit's a mess. And victory. Why am I suddenly Demesna too big? Well, I can hold on to a territory and give a castle to my son pretty soon. 
so that's not a problem. That can go, that can go. Is that an enemy ship? Hey, an enemy ship! You have 160 men there. I should be scared of that. It's a bit sad that I'm now fighting my grandson, but I want this territory. I want it ruled under my thumb, not under a thumb of my relation. I want direct control. Direct control. A hundred percent. This war, ladies and gentlemen, is over. It is over. We now lower the levies. We board the ship. And then we dump these people back and we sort out these kingdoms. Right now, people do not like me that much because of the... Wow, there is absolutely zero factions, though. Okay, first thing we do is we, lo is we uh, get these troops out, lower these levies as well. Right. Okay. There is my grandson, the King of Galicia and the heir of the Barony of Gartan. We can create the Duchy of Galicia. This is not a terrible plan. We shall create the Duchy of Galicia. The next thing we shall do is usurp the title of king. Sorry. I'm now the king. You are not the king anymore. You hate me. You absolutely and utterly despise me. How would you like to be my vassal? No. No. Wait ten years and then I'll crush you. Okay, so this is now mine. I am a few titles over my entitlement though, so I'm gonna have to hand some things over. I think it's finally time to hand Devon over. Because I would like Karuna. I would like it. Okay, so let's, uh, let's see here. My vassals. What, who do I have in my court that would suit? I have a lot of people in my court. I have a lot of people. I have you! I have you! Yes! Yes, actually, you'll be perfect! Would you like to be the Count of San Diego? In fact... Would you like to be the Duke of Galicia? Yes, you would. Marvellous. And I need to hand Devon over to someone. Someone who's not going to... Uh... I have a nephew. He's got no claims on anything. You, sir. Would you like to be the Count of Devon? You would. Excellent. Our Demes, our uh, Domain, or Demesna, or I've had a million people say different pronunciations for it, is a bit too large. However, we'll be giving away a castle to my son pretty soon, in two years. And someone is still desperate to marry my daughter. No. No, I will find someone to marry the daughter off matrilineally to. Like a Prince of Aquitaine, for instance. Hey, you see? That's quite a good... Oh. Died, eh? Kinda sucks. Oh well. Could have been my fault, that. Also, we have an empire here, by the way, that we have not yet founded. And I don't think we ever will in this playthrough. So yeah, we now own this. It's ours. We are a triple king. Isn't that awesome? It's awesome, isn't it? Three times king. We have factions that are non-existent. 
It's good. I like it. Call to arms. Honor your war against King Gunnar of Norway and someone else. But you're attacking him. You're attacking him. No. No. That's Norway. Norway is big. Not as big as it used to be. Sweden seems to be encapsulating bits of it. But I'm not fighting 4,000 men. I'm picking my fights carefully. Hmm. The potential for war. Do you have any allies? Not really, is the answer. The Earl of Gloucester? The Earl of Leicester? We'll use it. We'll use it. I wouldn't mind having that piece of territory just sat around doing nothing. Are any of you... Are any of you angry at me because of uh, raised levies? No. Demes the two bid, you're disappointed. Maximum feudal levies, medium crown authority, once control of X, once control of Y. Irrelevant. Let's go conquer Mercia, shall we? I want it. Please. And I think I might have picked a fight with a holy war. Unless they're just sitting there. Looks like they're just sitting there. Well, let's raise some pers some uh, levies. I don't even think I need to bring my own. This time. I actually lower that. I don't even need it. I don't even think I need to bring my own. An important decision can be made. What? Found the Holy Roman Empire? Oh, it's just been added, I thought. What? Send Stefan into hiding. Hmm, that is true. Go into hiding. Yeah. Just like, I'm going to hide now. Let us assess what your forces are like. There's another army here. I might as well uh, take them over there. How many boats? Ten? Twelve? Yeah. A thousand men there? There's a lot of boats here. Yeah, twenty boats. I think we'll just fight this war. It's not going to take for it. Whoa! That, uh, that war over there is a bit big. More over there is a bit big. That should actually be enough. No, no get on the boat. <laughs> the boat's right there, sir. No, I feel like I want to uh, navigate my entire way around this kingdom. <laughs> sir, that's a terrible idea. I know it is. However, I feel like I must. Also, this boat... Uh, this boat can move over there. You can board this boat and travel all the way over here. It's going to take you a while, but that's okay. I'm a patient person. I'll leave my own, my own levies here, just in case. Oh dear. There's really... Why are we losing here? Oh, there's an army. There is an army. I'm going to claim this. Aha! It is I. I am claiming this territory now. Ah, oh, my prince is now of legal age. He has become a skilled tactician. Excellent. Let us sort out a decent marriage for him. A duchess, duchess, princess, prince, princess of Aquitaine. Princess of France is looking better, though. 
Yes! I think I and France need an alliance! <laughs> ah, yes! <laughs> yes, that's good. That's really good. And every wealth is everyone's concern. And uh, you're unlanded. Would you like... The barony? Off you go! Like that, uh... Like that choice there. Also, still earning money. Which is good. <laughs> We're just gonna sit here on this siege and hope that we win. Failing that, we might lose. I'd like to win. My grandson lacks an heir. Well, I'm, I'm, I'm not doing anything. Why not? I'll educate him. I'm probably only going to die anyway, eventually. Ooh. We are losing troops there. Fortunately, our factions are pretty much non-existent. Just gonna sit here and wait for this war to end. He's turning out well. Uh, war score? 52%. Whoa! No, no deceitful trait, please. Are uh, you going to offer peace yet? No. I'm not interested. I don't wish to have peace. I love... Oh. He's called... This guy in. Oh, Brittany! Probably a bit too late, mind you. Probably a bit too late. Bearing in mind I haven't used any of my own personal levies, and you're fighting your own war as it is. My daughter. Yeah, you're fighting your own war, so... Getting other people involved might not be the best idea. Oh! 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 Oh, fortunately, they're not going after me yet. That's fortunate. They're going after them. What? You're not... You're against... Is that because you're a, a holy order? Or, I don't understand. In theory, you should be attacking me now. I saw a red... Saw red text, that's usually a bad sign. No? Uh oh. There are too many troops here. I'm losing uh, military strength here. Get off my territory! Thank you. Or oh, what's soon going to be my territory? I think picking this piece of territory up might be a mistake. However, they're leaving now. 70 odd percent war score. Nope, still not going to surrender? Right, we'll just wait it out. What was that? You've called in this guy. Pisa. Okay, now it's getting silly. Pisa? Really? You're calling in Pisa? Stop calling in like random people. Go. Leave. Leave this piece of territory, please. No, you're coming back, aren't you? Oh, this could be bad. I hope this war's over soon. Please. This, this ended up being quite bad. Maybe I shouldn't have poked my nose into this one. Well, there's other territories I can claim, but... Oh no no it's um there's enough people now. I've nearly won though. You do not want to mess around with Pisa. Sometimes those places can get absolutely colossally Oh Oh, here comes a fleet. Um Please win the war now <laughs> Please I don't want to lose all I just gained. Ninety nine percent. 
please surrender now. Yes. Yes. He's surrendering. He's surrendering. And now it's someone else's territory. The King of Africa. I can't beat the King of Africa. I'm... Yeah, that, that was a bit disappointing. I think it's time to go lick my wounds. It's time to go lick my wounds. I picked the wrong time to war there. When we come back, folks, we'll consolidate in the fact that we now have three crowns. And we'll try and hold on to it when I eventually die. I'll catch you later. See you then. Later. What a terrible war to end on.